Hi guys, welcome to a new video on Fake and Real just for you. Today we are going to be unboxing the Waymaster of the brand Manta Brew that started out with a funding on Kickstarter. I saw it, I was impressed, and now I received it. And today we'll do the unboxing. First thing is the actual simplicity of the box. It's pretty simple, pretty nice. It is a thick cargo box with nice information here on the back as you can see and let's open it up so the first thing is this strong firm foam protection layer pretty nice and then we have the main component here removing that is the smaller modules And moving that layer reveals a nice small box. Let's open this box up. Let's see what we got here. That's everything. We have a manual. Nice information. Probably the warranty, yeah, the warranty card, or warranty paper. We have a rubber mat, stickers, the cable with also the branding on it. Very sleek. And this is pretty hard, plastic. Also magnets, pretty cool. So let's continue with the scale itself. Now, open up the first part here. One. That aside, I think I can, yeah, thoughts up. Didn't have to open it up. Back here. this up this is the mug the main scale Let's remove this and there you have it two modules a mat can place right here really nice and sleek we have number one that clicks very firm and number two so let's see how this works i see buttons on the back so as you can see here a button the magnets so that is one thing we have some touch buttons here and this very cool screen that can tilt up down Ooh. so when I turn this you see here orange button and a white button now this one is a switch so may or may not be a sync part so we turn it on we get two beeps a light and also the charging connector that is a USB-C so very cool all right so that is now on let's connect these beep two times so probably it's now seeing that it's connected so let's just push the button hold oh there we go hello uh, it's this button uh -huh. so 
Moved on that side, the way is going. Ah, wow, both of them are now working. Sync properly, that's good. So, I got this screwing around, so let's just try. See what we got. 61, 61, same way. That's pretty good. So, they do work pretty good. So when I remove this, put it here, and if I put this here, oh, it still works. Let me just adjust this a bit, so you can guys see it. Both of them actually work. So you can attach this to anything that is metal and it will fix on that. So what do we have when we push? So when you push the button, it actually starts the timer. Push it again, it stops. Probably if we push it twice, it stops. What does this do? Yeah, don't need to. we'll figure out that later. Pass this back. It beeps every time twice when it is reconnected. So what do we have here? When we start, also a timer that starts counting. Double tap resets. Nothing happens. Double tap. Ooh. Now we have a different sign coming up there. Blinking, yeah. another icon. All right, so put this on top here. This for a bit. So when we look at the instructions here, see what we get. So the basic modes that we just saw, actually a let me double tap. This would be the pour over mode. We double tap again. This is espresso mode, so that's a small cup apparently. And when we do it again, it's the flow practice. Very cool animation, by the way. I do like the screen. Let me just put this over here. Double tap is a little tricky, but it does work. So let's put this back and like that. Let's move this display. So, oh, we have a main menu here. Weighing timer or over mode, as we saw just now. Not sure if you guys can see it. Just detach and show you up and close. So we have espresso mode. Tap again. Flow practice. Coffee water ratio. And then we have the waiting timer again. So apparently this is the select way. Awesome. Double tap. We get the main. So let's do Singapore overseas. Oh, nice. Oh, practice. That looks cool as well. Very nice. Let's go back to the wing tunnel. See what else we have. If we check the manual here for a bit we have the main menu and then we push both buttons and then you have sleep timer calibration mute unit sleeping timer Done. Okay. 
get the main menu, hold. Apparently there's a small glitch. It does not want to turn off anymore. So pushing the reset button, see what happens. Apparently it is stuck. Well, that sucks. Now oh, I probably need to wait until the battery runs out. Hmm. And when you, you open the back, you can actually see magnets. Kind of funny. But this sticks on any surface. So not only does the sides here stick, but also the bottom. That is also very cool. Thing now is it is now turning off. Well, apparently my clumsiness actually froze the whole system here. Doesn't want to respond, doesn't do anything. So um, Read this little part here is no longer functioning. It does work when you're actually weighing something, but it is actually frozen. Does not have any reset buttons. Designers to make like a reset button maybe here on in, on the bottom here in the back or somewhere here just to reset the system. So let's check this one up you have the option grams ounces milliliters and grams so those two options are available so that is actually what this side does so this is the simple part that weighs the options that you have, the, mo the modes. Pretty nice system. Firm magnetic connection. Let's turn this off. So the connection is actually pretty strong and the magnets there on the back. Very sturdy, it clicks very nicely. But sadly, this body part here is still not responding. Sadly enough, there are some more options that you can check. There are some extra options, and that is, as you can see here, the main, that is the weighing timer, the pour over mode, coffee water ratio, espresso mode, and the flow practice. Now these options you saw, then you have the advanced option in beginner mode, we have champion mode and brewing game. So I wanted to show you that, I have no idea what that is. But the sleep timer, calibration, mute and unit that we did see, only the advanced ones we did not get to see. Sadly enough, I have nothing else to show you guys. Again, sad enough, my clumsiness just froze the system. I'm unable to reset it. I just need to let the batteries drain, wait until it responds again. It is connected, it does work, you can wait. But sadly enough, the touch button does not work anymore. Nothing, everything is frozen in its place. So yeah, well, I have to, Cut this video short. So this is the new weight master of Mantapru. Um, small flaw in the system. So hopefully they can fix this. Hopefully with the new version they can fix this these little bugs. Also create a reset button on each module just in case something like this happens and someone like me clumsy enough does this the double tab needs to function a bit better but in general this looks amazing and actually the fact that you can actually attach this to any metal object and that is especially when you want to attach it to your coffee machine and then looking at the display wow the idea of this system is pretty cool but again there are some bugs that need to be removed and also some things that need to be added to this 
I hope you enjoyed this review of the Waymaster Manta Brew. Hopefully my clumsiness was not the reason not to buy this system. It's, in my opinion, pretty cool. It has a lot of functions and especially if you really, really expand the way you brew coffee, this is definitely a good option for you. I would definitely recommend this scale, but again, there are some things that need to be adjusted. So again, thanks guys for watching and hope to see you next time. Take care.